Are you alright? Right. That's just hard to explain, but we need to speak to Ryan again. Right, please. Uh, I'd rather not, mate. Thank you. Sure. Yeah. Ryan? Ryan, recognise me? Yeah, yeah. Do you know why I'm here? Yeah. Who have you been speaking to? Who have you been speaking to? On Instagram again. How old is she? Twelve. Why have you been doing this again? Nothing. You've just said, you've just admitted she's twelve. Yeah, I know. I ain't so it. why have you been doing this again? Mm -hmm. Yeah, half higher love. Hi, Sorry I'm about this, Tom. Come put some clothes on because you're going back to the police station tonight. Can you guys? He he's, 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 he's using, using it. He's now. messaging me now. He's Can you go and have a look, please, it? first on? I'm sorry to bring this to you again, love. Can I have a quick look and see what yeah, just posted? Yeah, of course he can't. Love, honestly. Because he's got no phone. That's because he's got no phone. Just from his phone, so that's his stuff at the top, 21 Sorry, Connected to your Wi-Fi. Make sure you have it to find out. It's connected to your Wi-Fi if you want. And this is for all the pictures. So he's got something stashed somewhere, Dolly. Same Instagram. I'm really sorry about this, Like I thought you were late after the last time, but he hasn't. He's using the same account as he was using the last time as well. Well, please, he's still got his phone. Ah, but he can still access his air. He's obviously got another one in there. Right, well, if you phone the police, they'll have to Yeah, they're on the way. Can I just ask him a couple of things? I just want to go through how this I'll has occurred. Through, I'll right? go through the police. police. Uh, so can I just tell you how this has occurred? So basically what's happened is we've had a few anonymous um, tips that he's been back on Instagram. Uh -huh. So what's happened is we've, we've um, informed them to obviously get in contact with the police so that they uh -huh. can look into it. However, what's happened is, is he's actually getting in touch with one of us and one of our decoys. Right. And then this is where the conversation started going from here. He's been straight in with his sexual again. Um, he's been asking for pictures, he's been sending pictures, he sent a live picture of him, which I can show you. Just hold up, please. Hold up. Keep up please. Mm, so this is again how it started there. So he started with here, right, and it's here, here. And then he sent that. There's black and white curtains there. Mm -hmm. And that was a live photo, so that was done at that precise moment in time. And it's mm -hmm. timed as live as well. Right. So it was from that actual point in time, mm -hmm. and then obviously he went on from there. Um, about the age she knows that she's spoiled just enough to hold up. Mm -hmm. um, all right, just want to step out here. I just want to ask you a couple of questions. We obviously you know how it goes, we're not going to hear you, I know, like that, you know what I mean. No, I just want to ask just why you've done it again. Just have a sit down if you want. That's fine, that's um, I didn't want to get you on camera, so I'm just going to stick the camera out there, mate. Like, do you want me to move out the way, sir, if you want me, yeah, I'm, I'm more than happy to do whatever you need me. Um, do you want to go with where it's a little bit quieter in the corner? It's up to you, wherever you want to go. Uh, yeah. Didn't tell you up to him. He's he's asked about this, by the way, love. He just wants to move away from your house. Wherever you want, do you want to go to the lamp post? So what's been going? What's been going on, Ryan? Well, I've seen that she was from, from last time. Just want to show me. I'll have a sit down with you, all right? Because you know I'm not an animal, and yeah, we've done this before. Um, yeah. So basically, what it is is right. I'll tell you. So we've had a few anonymous reports, right? Yeah. yeah. And the anonymous reports have been that you've been back on Instagram. Yeah. All right. Oh, Dan, tell Sue to move, please. So right. So we've had a few anonymous tips that you've been back on Instagram, yeah. okay? And you've been offering people money for nudes. Yeah. Yeah. Does that sound right? Yeah. Excellent. So these have been children again. 
All right. So what's happened is, is over the last couple of days, um, we obviously advised them to go to the police station and report you. Yeah. Yep. So what's happened is, over the last couple of days, you've actually got in touch with one of my decoys. All right. So for the last couple of days, you've actually been speaking to us. Now, we know what, exactly what you've been doing. We know exactly what you've been sending. Yeah. Now, if I was to say to you that you've been watching, would I lie to you tonight? Would that be fair to say that that's what you've been watching? Yeah. Yeah. Would it be right to say that you were masturbating yeah. at 18 minutes past nine this evening? I was only joking, what it even says on there. Right. So what I'm what I'm appreciating and I'm liking, Ryan, yeah. is, is you're not denying it. And yeah. you're speaking and, and you yeah. you're, you're being open and honest. But what I do want to know is 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 why are you back online? You've been released pending further investigation. Yeah. Now you said you said to somebody that uh, we got it wrong, we, we fucked up. Now what did you mean by that? How did we fuck up? Uh, like it's gone into further investigation, not hundred percent sure. Now, do you know what that means? Pen yeah, release yeah, pen yeah, and further yeah. investigation. So what happens is, is release pen and further investigation allows the police time mm -hmm. to send your device away mm -hmm. to be downloaded. That's all that is. Once that comes back, you will be charged, yeah. you will be going to court, and you will be found guilty. Mm -hmm. So what makes you think that from then to you going to court and now that you can just come back and do it again? You're using the same account, Ryan, as you were the last time? I'm not just going to make a new account. Uh, that's not the point, that's not what I'm asking you. I'm asking you why have you went back on and just started doing it all over again? Well, I thought it was a bit too weird how a 12 year old from your area was on it. Right. So Forget about this one, okay? Yeah. You've been speaking to other children in our area, so are you telling me you've been looking for us? I've been speaking to people in your area. You've been speaking to people from down that. Reports. From down that area. We're not going to go into it, but yeah. fair enough, we'll talk about this one. So you've seen somebody from our area. Mm -hmm. So you That's approached us, yeah. which is this one here where you started yeah. with, here, mm -hmm. how was you, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. yeah. So explain to me why you've went for this one. Because our 12-year-old, she said she was from your area, it was a bit suspicious how she was quite clever. Right. So are you telling me that you've done this to try and catch me? No, no. I was trying to catch me. I was just trying to work it out. Work what out? Myself. If it was you or not. And how if, would it was, if it was you or someone else like you. So why would you risk going back to jail and getting possibly remanded this time yeah. for trying to catch us out? Some of the things you've been saying, you haven't been trying to catch us out. You haven't. You've been saying exactly the same as what you were saying the last time. Exactly. You've got a profile. You're still saying that you're working. You're not working. But you're saying things that worked the last time because you know it works. Would I be right in saying that? I was working last time. You didn't? But you're not working now, are you? No. No. And why is that? Because what happened last time. And what happened last time? Got sent to prison. So why have you done it again? I don't know. Do you so one, of, one of the burning questions, right, is it's because your poor mum, alright, mm -hmm. she's absolutely adamant, and no doubt she's tried her absolute hardest <sighs> to stop you from doing this, right? So what device is it that you've used? To contact our decoy? Uh, an old mobile phone. So you have a mobile, mobile phone? Where is it? No. Right. But you will have to tell the police. You've told us. Mm -hmm. I appreciate that. that. Uh, you have know. to tell the police. Yeah, yeah. Do you know why I appreciate that? Sorry, sorry, Kane. Yeah, yeah. no, no, because now the police aren't going to rip your mum's house to bits looking yeah. for that phone. Because if you would have said that you didn't have it and you were lying, they would have tore that place to bits looking for that device. So. Are you watching Netflix on Ryan? Is that a games console? Yeah. What is it? PlayStation, Xbox? PS3. PS3. So. It wasn't Netflix, it was YouTube. So why on. I'm surprised they didn't take that the last time. Because generally they'll take anything that can connect to the internet. They will be taking it this time, obviously. I don't understand, Ryan. Like, I thought last time, like, when we spoke and you seen how distraught your mum was and. You know, you, you messed up your chance to go to Australia and all that kind of stuff. Like, I thought you would have learned your lesson, but it's like. To me, it seems that you thought, fuck it. Like, I can't, I'm not going to Australia anymore. I'm just going to carry on talking to children. You've obviously got a sexual attraction to children. Go to Australia? This was mentioned the last time. Oh, right. You've obviously got a sexual attraction to children. Right. Would you admit that? Would you, would, would you agree with me? Ish. Well, it's, not, the, not it's, 100%. it's a yes or no. Yes. Are you sexually attracted to children? Yes. <clears throat> you are. Right. Good. Again, honesty. Okay. Why haven't you seeked help for that? Did you know you could help? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm being very nice to you tonight, yeah, yeah. you know. Like, I didn't want to be tonight. I, I wanted to come up and I wanted to shout and ball at you and I wanted to tell you exactly what I thought of you because you've disgusted us 
absolutely mm -hmm. disgusted as I didn't think I was going to see you again until mm -hmm. the court date. And lo and behold, you've been talking to more real children because the last time it was a real child you were talking to, it wasn't us. We took over that account because the dad came to us, scared of you. We took that over. That's how we got you the last time. Mm -hmm. We've had numerous reports, again, like I say, from other parents anonymously, and they'll remain that way, that you've been trying to contact their children on Instagram again. And then, but all of a sudden, bang, he started talking to us. I couldn't believe it. I said, no, this is kind of be, he's not that stupid. He's not. But you are, but, so you've got a sexual attraction to children. It's the first time you've said this out loud. I said it at the police station. Did you? Yeah. Were you honest with them? Yeah. Do you mind just asking what was said and what happened? Like, uh, I don't, we can't talk too much obviously because yeah, it is an ongoing yeah. investigation so just keep it sort of brief like you know yeah, yeah. Um, they, did, they did ask those questions and I did agree to them right, so you were open and honest so yeah. you were basically honest yeah. at the first so, so did you go guilty did you yeah. Yeah. honestly I was scared to start with but I was honest yeah that's fine I mean, it's understandable to be fair and mm. I'm, I, I didn't know how the night was going to go <clears throat> I didn't know if your mum was going to be distraught again I didn't yeah. I don't get it. What weren't happy was that it went on straight away online without asking for Do you not think you deserve it? Well, technically it should be given permission first. Why should it be given permission? Did anybody yes. give you permission to talk to children? No. So, <laughs> what makes you think that I should ask your permission when you've been talking to children if I can post you online? Are you mad? me saying that gives you permission to come to my door. I can come to your door if I want. You told me where you lived the last time. You were the one that gave us the address. I'm, I put it this way, everything I do, I do within yeah. the law. Everything. Re everything. I wouldn't be sitting yeah. here, I wouldn't be ringing the police. There's new laws just come in, um, that they're going to be tougher yeah, yeah. on offenders who are talking to decoys. Now, with decoys who you've been talking to for the last couple of days, what they're now saying is they're going to treat it as if it's a real child. You were right. talking to a real child the last time. This is not stacking up well for you, Ryan. Why are you bringing this to your door? Like, there's got to be a reason. You're saying that you're attacking your children. But if that's the case and you know this, then why aren't you talking to people? You've got a loving mother there. Surely she would help you out. Yeah. You know, I'm sure of it. I mean, I'm surprised she's put you back up in the house. If you were my son, you wouldn't be back in. You wouldn't. But. So. You are fan clash the kids. For needs. I was not from kids. It's fine. So, what's going on with this? You sent that the other day, didn't you? Yeah. That's what we'll call a live photo. Yeah, yeah. I know that. So, so what that yeah. means is, is yeah, 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 yeah. it's stamped. Yeah, yeah, I know. And it's been sent I'm to honest. us. Yeah, yeah. So, again, there's no denying that this is you. But, yeah, 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 I know you're that. not. You're not. I mean, is there anything you want to say to me? No. You've got a chance. I mean, last time I caught you, you probably had loads going through your mind, and yeah, yeah. you probably had loads to say when I was gone. You know, like get it off your chest now. I'm happy to, to, to hear to what you've got to say. Gone through it all. Do you think I'm wrong when I do? No, no. That's yeah. good. That's good. Do you think? Do, do you think that the country needs people like us? Yeah. Do you think that what you do and people like you are a cancer on this society? And our children are getting ruined because of people like you. Yeah. I agree. I'm not going to call you this, but I'm going to ask you. Would you say that you were a paedophile? Yes. Because of what's happened. Fair enough. Fair enough. See, generally, once you're convicted, that's when you can be called a paedophile. However, a paedophile is, is an attraction yeah. to, to children. And if you're saying that's right, then I would say that was the correct word for you. But you've said it, and mm -hmm. I agree. And I mean, you must have got some shit the last time, did you? No, I didn't. Anybody like get in touch with you? Or... No. See, oh, I was thought one lad. I thought that would have put us. That, I, I was, was just one lad. well, we don't want any names or anything yeah. like that. But I thought that would have put you off. But he sent us a message, but obviously I didn't know it in the chat. Mm -hmm.
I'm just trying to get my brain around it, like, I kind of I get my head around it, like, I didn't, like I said, I didn't think I could sit in front of you. I haven't been on Messenger or Facebook. You've been on Instagram? Yeah. Exactly where you were the last time? Yeah. The same app, the same age group. Like, you admitting this, hopefully, I don't know what helps out there for you, do you know what I mean? I don't believe there is any, personally. However, there is people out there that, that believe it can be treated. If you can, then I suggest that you seek that help. Because I wouldn't be surprised, I would actually hope that you were remanded this time. Yeah. You've been released pending further investigation. I will be hoping now, because of this, and because of the second time, and because you're admitting everything again, I, w I would hope that you would be remanded because you're a danger to children. Yeah. Would you agree with that? I wouldn't say I'm a danger, but I know where you're coming from. Could you be trusted around children? Some children. What, what children could you not be trusted around? Uh, like people who are like lawyers and people who are just being... Somebody's crying there. My sister. Like, do not name that person. I will, don't worry. Thank you. So she's upset now? Right. How does that make you feel? Upset. Bad. Can you hear that? Yeah. She's got to live with this as well. You're related to her. She carries your name. Look. You're fucking dead to me, son. See? Don't you fucking dare. I don't blame her. Do you? No. I'm not sorry for my sister and I'm heartbroken for her. I'm, I'm literally nearly in tears because of that back, because of what you've done. It destroys not just your family, the children's family that you're talking to, as well as everybody else affected by it. And I know you'll recognise me, and that's fine. Yeah. Do you recognise her? Yeah, yeah. You do realise thought... the first time you were caught, she was there as well. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I, th I, th I thought it was her that was saying... No, you uh, didn't. That's why I said she the looked older is, than what she was. The thing yeah. is, like, right, you know, you've said you thought she was too clever and, and this sort of thing, right? But yeah. before you even got to testing out her maths and testing out her school lessons, mm -hmm. you'd already been vital to her. Right? You'd already told her how to do things to herself. This is stuff that not even adults would talk to each other about, right? Never mind children. You didn't think it was her. I when she went, I didn't know exactly it was her, but when you approached her, I was, I was. That was my first thought. Does you recognise her, or is you going to recognise her? Yeah. And the way your chat went, you did not have a clue. You didn't say what you want. You thought you were being clever at points where you were saying, um, what was it? Oh, I would only be joking if I masturbated all over your face. Like that's you trying. So when you go to 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 questioning, you can say, "Well, look, I was only joking," and you're hoping that they'll say, "Oh, it's time you laughed, Ryan. Sorry about that." That's what you did that for, isn't it? Yeah. You were deleting your messages as well, trying to be clever, weren't you? Because I thought it was going to be. Well, it was. Yeah. It has been. Every single one of them, the ones you've deleted, they're there. You know how we work, Ryan. Tell her that this is recording just in case. We don't want any personal information out. We've got other people to protect. So you heard this though? Yeah. You didn't look like you bothered. Like, this is your family again. You've got that same stupid fucking look on your face. Like, you do not care. You haven't learnt your lesson. You haven't learnt your lesson. I thought you would have learnt your lesson by now. But no, within a matter of months, you're back at it again. Doing exactly the same thing again. Doing this to your family again. This is the second time I've had to watch your family cry. The second time. I'm a fucking human as well. We've got feelings. Yeah. You're a fucking disgrace. Absolute disgrace. Look at her. She can't even look at you. Do you blame her? No. <clears throat> and it's my team that's got to go and console your sister because of your actions. And now they're going to be up all night. Sorry, Kim. We've caught so many people. So, so many people. 
now and we call people who have done it a second time, call people who have done it a third time, right? Yeah. But what you're doing to this family, what you're doing to your family, right? And after the first time, they've done everything that they possibly can to stop you from doing it again. And what you've done, you've completely and utterly smashed their trust to pieces. You've stamped on it. You've gone behind their back and you've gone out of your way to use an old mobile phone. Do it all over again. We're under no illusion that, you know, that this is a small place. That neighbours know you, neighbours know your family. And the fact that you were willing just to get a little tiny bit of gratification to put your family through that all again. I mean, does that not... Do you not comprehend how completely and utterly ridiculously selfish that actually is? Do you not understand that it just screams volumes that you think about yourself and nobody else? Of course I think about other people. You obviously don't. In your in your little world, Ryan's number one. And it's that symbol. And you can tell by your actions. Your actions speak fucking loads more than what your words do. You thought you were being clever, right? Just being consistent with the, the messages. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Didn't you? But you knew what you were doing was wrong. You said to her that you would get in trouble for it. That it was wrong for somebody her age. Yeah. You were fully aware of it. But you still carried on. The fact, the fact that your family want to live somewhere else. I don't know how long they've lived here. I don't, but I've no doubt that this place is a lovely little community. And you've, you've given them, you've made them feel like the only option for them is to leave, to start again somewhere else. No words? No. Is he right? Yeah. You'll be sat in a nice plushy cell and your family will have to deal with all the repercussions of that. That is like, that's, that's absolutely fucking broke my heart out. I thought after the time you spent in the cell the last time you would have had time to think. What did you think about when you were in that cell the last time? I didn't think, I just slept. Oh, so you just slept? Yeah. Oh, so fucking hell. So you, just, you, you just no said. Remorse, you had no guilt. It's fine. You, you, didn't, you didn't feel sorry for what you were going to put your family through, what you'd already put them through. You just had enough. I'm, I'm just being honest. You just slept. But that to me just seems like you do not give a fuck. I, if I'd have been pulled into a police station, accused of sexual offences, I would not have slept for days. <laughs> but you, you get put in question, you have a little nap. Oh, that's alright. Get your fucking head down. Now your mum's going to want to go through this again. Taught us. Tell us. I see you've already been through everything. Tell us. Tell us what's going on. I don't know. Well, are you having problems in your life? Like, you've said you're sexually attracted to children, so to me, even if you did have a problem in your life, you would still be sexually attracted to children. If your life was 100% perfect, you had everything, you would yeah. still be sexually attracted to children, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Yeah. So there's not much more to say to you. You're sexually attracted to children, i.e. you're a paedophile. You should be treated as one. You should be jailed as one. That's what should be happening. There's a lot of people out there who think that a lot worse should happen. But I do believe, slowly, that the, the judicial system in this country is starting to take a small step towards clamping down on people like you. So what do you think your brother's going to make of this? I don't know. Is he in? No. Thank fuck for that, eh? Please. And you could, good job we don't go live as well, because everybody would have been watching wherever he is. But you are right, this isn't live for now. It will be going on the page. I'm not asking you permission, I couldn't give a fuck. But you're lucky it's not live, so he doesn't know what's going on. And hopefully they haven't rang and told him. Because I would have a funny feeling we wouldn't be sitting here as calm, would we? No. Exactly. That poor bloke as well. I'm not even going to speak about him, because it's not right.
Well, I've got a brother. And I would be out for him. But if he done anything like what you've done, it would tear me to bits. I wouldn't speak to him again. I would sting him, me. I would come and sit with him like this. I would put him behind fucking bars. Michael, I wouldn't even have the police anywhere near you. Murder him yourself. Yeah, you can. I must just be a nice guy, yeah. I would help you do prison time. But my point is, you know, we're not violent. We're not here to come and cause you any harm. I could be shouting and bone, I told you before, I really wanted to come and shout at you tonight. What's the point? What's it going to achieve? Nothing. Nothing. And now I've heard that could possibly be an hour before the police get here. So we're going to have to sit very uncomfortably for the next hour. You weren't expecting this, were you? No. Because you didn't have a clue it was us, did you? I thought it was going to be something to do tomorrow or something you would have came. You did? did you, are you sticking with that story? You thought it was us? You knew it was us? Not, not 100%. I had a rough idea. Even, even if you hadn't answered, right? <coughs> right. Let, 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 let's just go with your little we all a theory, right? And you did. Right. Let's say you had a 50 50. You know, you were 50% convinced right. it was us. You're even more stupid than you thought for still it. thinking it was us and saying what you said. Did you not realise you were still breaking the law trying to catch us out? Yeah. And I tell you what it is you have called out and we're back at your address and you're going back to the jail, the cells. So if you think it's a game, I can tell you who you fucking lost. It's not a game, Ryan. We don't enjoy this. I've been to work all day. They've been to work all day. You know what I mean? We, we've we got work tomorrow. But no. We'll come out. We'll sit in the cold on a curb under a light. With a self-proclaimed paedophile. Do you think I enjoy this? No. <coughs> if anything happens, or anybody comes, I want you to run, it's the police there, mate. That was quick enough, wasn't it? Oh. Alright, man, you just stay there, mate. <laughs> Is there anything you want to say before you go back? Uh, can I get a drink before I go out the That's not up to me. Are you going to carry on doing this? No. Are you going to stop, please? Oh, yes. yes, I'll. I'm yes, asking I'll try, you. I'll try. And I'm being nice. I will try. Hello again. Yeah, <laughs> stay there, mate. Yeah, you are. Over here last time, yeah. Yeah, so are we, mate. Do you want these pulled up? Pardon? Oh. So what's happening now is, is they're just going to go and present our evidence. Um, you stand with me, they'll come over and then they'll arrest you. You know how it goes. I think a lot of people, when they're watching this, they're going to think I've been very, or, or too calm with you. I believe I've been too calm with you. However, as I've said before, I don't believe Sam shouting, and I'm not going to stand shouting outside your mum's door. Out of respect for her, it's the last thing she needs. You've damaged this place enough. The last thing she needs is me shouting the bone. You can look at me, get a good look at me face. Second time. You do know over well, 200,000 people have viewed your last video. 200,000 people have seen your face. Think how many are going to see this one. And it's just going to re cement exactly what you are and you've admitted it this time. We've, to be fair, we've spoke a lot more this time, haven't we? Yeah. You didn't really say much the last time. I think you were a bit shocked. Yeah. Whereas this time, we've caught you in the act because you were actually talking to us all the way up here. <laughs> telling us what you're watching, sending us pictures of your TV programme, telling us exactly what you were doing. And then you've come to the door in your boxer shorts. You were masturbating over this child well, at 20 been. past nine. Why well, say it? I was masturbating over. Oh wait, I'm not stupid. And who were the pictures you were sending? I don't, I don't want names, but they weren't your ex, were they? Yeah, we were talking. That wasn't your ex? We were talking. So does that person know? That you're sending the pictures? No. Is this your brother? Yeah. Keep 
Oh, don't you tell me to keep me going down, lad. Yeah, mate. Let's come this way. Yeah. There he is. Hello, mate. It's not live on port of this. Oh, yeah, sorry. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. I just mentioned his brother. I want to see the arrest. No, I was just keeping an eye on his brother. Have you got a family got a stay in your stay? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Arrest me now. No suspicion of inciting an under 13 year old into such activity. Alright? Okay. I have to arrest you. The necessity to arrest you. Yeah. This is a very fair harm yeah. to young people. Okay. And before I put you in the van, I'm going to search you. But before I do that, I'm going to turn this off. Alright? Yeah. Anything you want to say? No, 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 no. It's on a holiday, mate. You need a drink? Well, that will make you want to go and live. We'll get you a drink when you get this. Phone's in the house. Um, were you just filming us? Not you, no. I was at the floor. I'll show you. 